hi everyone welcome to my channel my name is Sakile if you want to subscribe hit on the subscribe button if you want to be notified of the videos that I post as I post on a daily basis hit on the notification button do not forget to like to share and comment on my videos welcome is actually to God's greatness and to God's goodness hallelujah thank you so much beloved for the love and the support that you keep on showing me on this channel may God richly bless you amen today the Lord is saying she might not be ready so you have to keep on waiting she might not be ready, so you have to keep on waiting. Hallelujah. Let us look at the book of Genesis chapter 9 verse 17 to verse 20. It says, there was no sparkle in Leah's... We will start from verse 16. It says, now Laban had two daughters. The older daughter was named Leah and the younger one was Rachel. There was no sparkle in Leah's eyes, but Rachel had a beautiful figure and a lovely face. Since Jacob was in love with Rachel, he, he told her father, I will work for you for seven years if you give me Rachel, your younger daughter, as my wife. Agreed, Laban replied. I'd rather give her to you than to anyone else. Stay and work with me. Verse 20 says, So Jacob worked seven years to pay for Rachel, but his love for her was so strong that it seems to him for a few days. Hallelujah. God today is saying, she might not be ready. You will have to wait. Hallelujah. If you read at the book of Genesis 29 verse number 1. It says. It says. Verse number 1 says. He saw a well in a distance. Through flocks of sheep and goats. Lay in an open field beside it. Waiting for the water. But a heavy stone covered the mouth of the well. It was the custom today to wait for all the flocks to arrive before removing the stones and watering the animals afterwards the stones will be placed back over the mouth of the well jacob went over to the shepherd and and asked where are you from my friends we are from here and they answered do you know a man that named Laban, the grandson of Noah, he asked. Yes, we do, they replied. He is doing well, Jacob asked. He is, yes, he is well, they answered. Look, here comes his daughter Rachel with the flock now. Jacob said, look, it's still broad daylight. It's too early to run up the animals. Why don't you water the sheep and go so they can get back to their pasture? Hallelujah. So if I read first Genesis chapter one verse verse Genesis twenty nine verse one, it gives us the story of David's pay of uh, uh, it gives us the story of Jacob's patience and Jacob's waiting. We're looking at Jacob when he comes into this land, his first guiding the seven that he found there on how to work with sheep and goats. That way he was able to note Rachel. Hallelujah. But when you look at verse 18 to verse 20, it says David was willing to wait. Hallelujah. God can shift things, can make you wait for a while while she's still preparing. Why your partner is still ready is still not ready enough hallelujah when we look at the at the at verse 17 to 20 it says in the period of seven years Jacob was waiting for Rachel and seven Rachel's father as in return of Rachel to be to be to be his wife hallelujah God is saying there are things that will make you wait even if you know that this is your godly ordained spouse but you will have to wait for a moment you will have to wait whether God is still building the person whether God is still maturing the person whether God is still adding blessings whether God is still doing something but there is a period where you know this person is the right spouse for me but God says this is the time I want you to wait it took seven years while he already knew this is my spouse he took her it took him seven years saving knowing that this girl this woman will be my wife some people fail to wait when they even know that they are in love. They try to rush things. They try to make things work faster. I believe when when Jacob was still saving Laban, there were things, there were challenges that were, were coming up. There were things that were happening. God is saying, as much as you have seen, as much as it is shown that this person is your ordained spouse, but be able to wait for the day the Lord will say it is time. Stay blessed and continue to watch this channel in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen.